you know, most he'll, he'll definitely love, yeah. love One, going to America. Go. So you're feeling like super deserves to go to America. Go send, go send him a donation. I, f I feel like he, I might drop him, I might drop him a couple pounds. I'm not sure. When I get money at least. Thank you. Yeah. All right. See you guys later. We'll be dropping off the GP. What's up? On the commentary for today. You won't want to have the headset around your neck because we don't have any sound. Oh, okay. Anyway, we're going into winners finals today. We got Zone versus Ixis, and they are the wrong way around. So let's swap that real quick. Headcoin's actually a bad matchup for Sonic. Um, it's been said several times that Corrin gives, gives Sonic a hard time. I can definitely see it. I feel like it's very difficult for Sonic to deal with. Okay. Uh, you see Zone with the with the percentage lead for the time being, so I can definitely see why. Uh, I feel like both of these characters really like the stage as well. Yes. It just gives them so many options. Calling out, calling out Ixus there. This, this is going to be, like most Sonic games, it's going to be a game pretty much built around the attri the war of attrition. Trying to keep the percentage lead. Yeah. Ixus is just moving so fast on the people. You just don't know what to do next. I mean, I mean, the weight of the unfortunate Sonic really does struggle to get in as a character. Um, well, or more to the point, you get in, and in a way that's easy to, you know, like actually leads to a fruitful result. Yeah. So you, most of the time, you'll see people play a very defensive game against Sonic and not commit to things in order to basically make him do something risky. Exactly. I, I like the way uh, Zoni's holding shield as well. Just, uh, many a time you see people just spot at that moment. That's it, they get caught by That's very, very well played by Zone. Zone's just got a percentage lead for the time being. This can go with any singular hit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a huge hitbox on that up B. You really like reach through the stage far further than you think. Oh, it was going for the back air there as well. Yeah, just, I'm just misspaced it. Gonna say that does not look like that was true. But hey, if it works. You're gonna see Ixus play like a really dry game for the time being, just trying to get little nick, little nicks in here and there. The ball is in, the zone's got it. He's got he's yeah. the one who's got to make the play because he's locked down. And this is really where Ixus will thrive. He'll just rack up damage. Yeah, you see it happening already now. Yeah. I mean, Zone knows he needs to get in and do something about this percentage. And look, he's still a quick pick for one so, so fast. And the battlefield really helping with the larger blast zones there. Now Sonic to live that up anyway. I think on any other stage I probably would have killed. I wonder how hard it is for Corey to catch Sonic in this stage. I feel like due to the due to the platform layout, Sonic can kind of run around and do a lot of what he wants to with Corey. Like really struggling to keep him pinned down. By that same merit, it's one of the short round stages. That should kill any moment now. Kill very soon. Okay. I think he's looking for that grab. Yeah, the up throw shouldn't kill now, but. Ix is doing such yeah. a good job. He's done over. He's done nearly 100% here without losing his stock. Is that? No, no, no. Oh, so Damn, that was that was a clean, clean edge guard by Ix. That back is so strong. It really matters who gets the first stock, doesn't it? Because in this situation here, it seemed like Zone was under the pressure of having to. Get that stop quickly so that every, every attack would actually count them towards the next stop. Exactly, man. It's, it's, what, it's what we said earlier that war of attrition just makes it so important for who gets the percentage lead, who gets the first stop. Because once a first stop's gone, the other person's on the back of it. They got to chase. And this is not a matchup where you want to be the one chasing. You don't want to be chasing Sonic. I mean, Sonic doesn't want to be chasing Corrin either. Yeah. Alright, percentage lead already. 
this regard to that. Yeah. Oh, wow. wow. Huge damage off that down air to side leave. It's like 18% on that. Game. I like the option of holding back there. He's just got caught. So, most of the time, the X's have been caught by the other. Yes, yeah. yes. Oh, I just missed the conversion there on that uh, pig. Stage by gonna do it for him there. Is it first to three on this one? Yeah, this is the best of five to win this final. So. Let's kick again. He's been very aggressive with those, he's worked out for the most part. Is it safe if he does it off stage? Uh, no, he does it off stage and he won't get like strictly punished for it. By the same merit, he's now off stage. So it's basically a stage control versus like straight up punish. I'm assuming that the uh, spring spike, uh, the spring kick doesn't really work. Oh, what? Alright. I think, uh. Okay. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm astounded. I'm assuming the stage, uh, so this, uh, game doesn't work, the spring game doesn't work on, uh, Corrin's recovery. You know the spring. Um, obviously, the spring is a projectile. So if it clanks with a um, if it clanks with a hitbox and an up then it's not gonna not gonna hit him out. Gee, I thought I was gonna do it. Okay. Yeah, it's it was very clever stuff from Zone there to land on the spring. Not a lot of people notice, but if you land on a spring, so like Mega Man's Rush or Sonic Spring, you actually get your double jump back. Are you serious? Yeah. I did not know that. So if you're struggling to land, you can, there's a spring that you land on it and you get you get more options back. So it's almost like landing on a platform? Pretty much! Okay! I really didn't know that. Yeah, I mean, the more you know, man. Yeah, this one's looking a lot closer than the first game. They've managed to keep it a pretty even Ooh. field. Why do you use some... Uh... Oh, How did that, that work? So he countered the spin dash and uh, X's immediately jumped out of it. With, and did an, did an air dodge. Okay. You'll see Sonic's, if they get their... Uh, they get their um, spin dash witch time. Yeah. They'll do that as well. Okay. Nice. Oh, from zone. And is that based on momentum, right? So they have to have that kind of spin dash momentum. No, as long as they jump out immediately. Uh, Baron. Baron, you've got to play Pop Tart. Play him back there. Still looking very close. Corrin can take this with any major hit. That was not the cleverest option I've ever seen. Oh, he yeah, waited yeah. on the air dodge. Yeah. Very well played from Pop Tart. Pop Tart, Ixis. Shut up, Pop Tart. Oh, winner is. to Ixis in winner's finals. Why don't say winner's semis? Whoops. I think Zone was a winner last, uh, last week. Yeah, Zone won last week's meltdown. He's proving that he can, uh, well. He's getting quite far every time, to be honest with you. He's definitely a strong player. He does very well whenever he's at Meltdown. I feel like the more relaxed environment definitely suits him as a player. Very controlled. Damage off one spin dash. Pretty one of that spin dash used to do 6-4%. Really? Yeah. After the nerf. Yeah, yeah, it got nerfed. Same, same time back for got nerfed. Yes, yes, I remember that. Yo! Okay, oh no, ju a, a couple more percent and that would have killed. This is really going to have in this uh, last game. Potential last game. So, count the chickens before the hatch for a yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's going so aggressive, has yet to do, yet to take a hit. Okay. We see a zero to death here. He's so slippery, like, you can see, you can see his own swinging and he finally gets himself on the board. Okay, you can see. You can see, like, so, 40. Like, I, I really do feel like letting, letting X go to his triplats has hurt his own. Because I know he wants to be able to trap him on the platforms. Yeah. But Sonic, Sonic thrives so much with those. Yeah, Sonic's so fast that he's not really a safe option for 
So to do that, as opposed against other characters, it can be a safe option. True way, but against Tommy, just too quick. Okay, yes. Not too sure why they didn't hit it, but. So working, working on getting his back without taking too much damage on his, on his own. It's very possible for him to break, bring his back very quickly. Okay. I like that option. Just in case he uh, decides to spin dash it. Oh, very risky for him landing right on top of the spin dash. Yeah. Yeah. And you'll see X is going back to how we played game one, trying to you know, bait, bait his own yeah. into making the team. See the mistakes yeah, and stuff. Being a bit too aggro. I don't mind that straight attempt there, so with a lot of time, people would expect that you think they're going to air dodge or something. Sometimes it's just good just to go straight for the attack. It's something like that. It's, it's like a no mix up mix up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, got caught sleeping. Sometimes you can forget that Corrin can actually do that. That's the annoying thing. You think you're safe on the legend, but before you don't just get pinned as a little crap, you forgot you can actually do that. Yeah, so terrifying. You can't wait a second for Corrin. Because if you realise that you're gonna wait, you're gonna wait. Oh, we'll stab your hands. And despite the incredibly dominant first stop, this is looking reasonably even. Yeah, he's doing a really good job in trying to bring this back. Especially after nearly getting him for that first one. You see both of them playing such a patient game, no one wants to engage. You see it, the inst instant X is realizing it's coming in, ready on that spin dash. Okay, they're not gonna take it, very close. Nice pyro grab in his own. You see that you see X has retreated or escaped the ledge so many times thanks to the top platform. Yeah. Doing yeah. the instant spin shot off the ledge. Just give him such a free kick out of jail free I think it's impossible to punish that, is it? Uh, you, you have to be ready, you have to be like ready to punish it before it even happens. It's like it's if so he sees fast. it, he's gonna go there. He didn't have to go there. Well. Exactly. It's, like, it's so difficult. Back throw. Not gonna take it just that was it. Three nil to X. This wow. X is looking very dominant in that game. Oh, winner that was almost too easy. Right, so we are waiting on losers semi-finals here. So the way it pans out in the bracket, which I will now post because I didn't get time to fix the nightbot today. Sorry about that, guys.